good evening. But between this and uh, oh, and uh, other clips, I uh, would like to present to you a few uh, examples of hand archery. Anyway, let me just. Uh, I mean, first portion is live, so let me just uh, see if we can get that set up here. Huh. Well, let me look at that. Anyway, see my hand. See my hand. Okay. Let's uh, see how we draw a side shoe here. As we have been doing the whole time ever since 2000. Let's do this and that. And the ear there. Saturate the uh, things there. Give him a masculine looking chest. I kind of messed up on that one, but oh well. I'll work with it. Give the thumbs up there. Now that there. The old brown stripes. Uh, give him that there. The old tail. Try to put his little shoes on. Give him a little lift up the foot look there. Put my little C in a circle and my John Hancock. And let's give him a little drop shadow underneath. Now we break out the uh, markers. Mm, Coming the old mouth with the flesh color. Crayola rocks. Uh, Color his arms. Uh, his belly, belly and chest, whatever you want to go, How, whichever you want to call it. Yeah, it's sticking out. I'll play back later. Okay, uh, regular yellow. Oh, I forgot the eyebrows. There you go. Look at that. Make him look smart. He's slick. Slick character. Yes. Uh, just hurry up to the coloring. Oh, I didn't close the hand. There you go. Got a little better on this, but no press for time. But it basically, definitely looks like. Uh, but yeah, it's my it's my style, my handwriting, my hand drawing. It's uncopyable. Hmm. Give his little red cheeks. Lime green sofa eyes. Good shade of brown on the old stripes. And the edge in the bottom portion of the tail. His shoes there. Barry Blue. Favorite shade? Sign you sneakers. Funny, funny shape. I'll make you do funny things. And we'll, uh... Accentuate the blackness on the tips of his ears, his nose, and uh, where's that gray? Oh, here it is. Make his salt, make his sneaker soles shades of gray. Oh, and uh, while I got this uh, up and about, uh, let me uh, make a switcheroo here. Actually, you know what? Uh, let's do a little, one more thing. 
art and care for Casey. Anyway, now for the old switcheroo, let's uh, close this up here and put in the hand drawn pages of book number zero. Let me just re angle this a bit. The old history of the hand drawn. Print these out. You get blank sight, you get blank edges. Unedited. As they originally were before, I scanned them and typed the text into them. Oh, that's a good page. Very good page. Oh, uh, yeah. But just kind of like the introduction of Excel Saga back in episode 2 of Excel Saga. So I was Arjunai, I was Arjunai, I she she day. Mmm. Kissy kissy. Yum. You know, you can pause at any time, but I'm just going though quickly because I don't want to kill over 10 minutes in this. Anyway, from there. Oops. There goes the creation. There goes the creation. Oh well. Anyway. Hmm. Anyway, I want to again give a shout out to Casey. I care about you very much. Your feelings mean a lot to me. You mean a lot. I'm sorry, Casey, but I'm afraid that, uh, well, I tried to uh, ease you into the subject, but unfortunately, I just could not do that. I just had to give it to you straight, as my uh, friend made, made me realize when I talked to her earlier tonight, in addition to you. I'm sorry, Casey, but, you know, you fell in love with Science You and Rose You in the world of Quakeville. It's mine. Originally, mine. I'm the guy. March 17, 2000, in front of Miss Naomi Chai Fu's classroom at Manchester High. Freshly drawn. You saw it from my own hand. I'm, I'm the artist. But anyway, as to uh, further elaborate, the imposter's real name is Jeff. I know this because I learned his name is Jeff from a D A N T O P U L T I S at yahoo.com. And also, if you take a good look, if you also, if you, uh, if you ever see him in person, look at his ID. Look at his ID. You'll know that it's fake. Look, ask, ask him to hand it to you personally. It's fake. I can hand you mine anytime. I'm my wallet. It's real. As well as uh, my, as well as my diplomas and degrees, they're just right here in my room, right here. In these four walls that have that Sancho and Rose Shoe in the world of Quickville have evolved from. I'm sorry, Casey. I didn't mean if I hurt if I hurt you, I'm sorry. But I had to, I had, I, I want to let you want to make sure you knew the truth. You had to know. You have been dating and having relationships with the imposter. His name is Jeff. I'm sorry. But I care about you. I do. Just like you have been talking to me the past two nights. Rigatoni. But yeah, I would definitely recommend you confront Jeffrey. <sighs> I'll leave it up to you, Casey. Be safe. Stay strong. Take your time. I care about you, as I cared about all my other gal pals in my life. From Megan Schroeder, Tiffany, Miranda, Sarah, Kelly. Even all the ones I made on the internet. My Australian gal pal, Sarah Cassandra McKenzie, Panda Halo, died in that brush fire. And Sarah Jackson died in the automobile accident. And Ivy O'Neill recently. I had to go listen to my father's me head theories. I'll leave it up to you. I care.